Welcome to our exploration into the dynamic world of agriculture, where understanding different farming methods can unlock incredible opportunities. Today, we're diving into eight distinct ways of farming, each tailored for specific goals and advantages. Whether you're an aspiring farmer, an investor, or simply curious about the agricultural world, this video could be your first step toward making informed decisions that might turn you into a millionaire in the coming decades. Sounds exciting, right? In our comprehensive guide, we will cover eight common methods used for agriculture farming. First up, traditional farming. This method focuses on basic farming for self-consumption using minimal technology. It's about getting back to the roots of farming. Next, we explore industrial farming. Here, we see agriculture on a grand scale, massive production powered by heavy mechanization. It's the powerhouse of global food supply. Moving on to organic farming. This method uses natural processes without synthetic inputs, including biodynamic and natural farming approaches. It's all about purity and sustainability. Protected agriculture comes next, where innovation meets cultivation. Think greenhouses, hydroponics, aeroponics, and vertical farming, creating optimal conditions for crop growth year-round. Mixed farming integrates the cultivation of crops with livestock rearing. It's a symbiotic system that enhances biodiversity and farm productivity. Extensive farming utilizes large land areas with minimal inputs, focusing on efficiency and larger ecological balance, including pastoral farming. Then there's intensive farming, where the output is maximized from smaller land areas through high input and innovative techniques like market gardening. Lastly, conservation agriculture emphasizes soil preservation with practices like zero tillage and permaculture, protecting the earth for future generations. Stay tuned as we unpack these methods, providing you with clear concepts and actionable insights. Ready to explore the possibilities and maybe find your path to agricultural success. Let's get started. Traditional farming, deeply rooted in the heritage of agricultural practices, is experiencing a transformative shift across the globe. Historically characterized by manual labor and basic tools like hand sticks and hoes, this method has been fundamental in sustaining many rural families in developing countries. Traditionally focused on meeting the immediate food needs of a family with little to no surplus for market sale, these farms operated on small plots of land, ranging from one to five acres, with labor-intensive work carried out by family members. However, the narrative of traditional farming is changing with the integration of modern technology. Today, even small landholders are increasingly adopting advanced machinery, previously accessible only to larger industrial farms. This evolution is bringing significant efficiency improvements. Tractors are now commonly employed for tilling, reducing physical strain and enhancing the efficiency of land preparation. Harvesting machines streamline the gathering of crops, minimizing losses that were typical of manual processes and accelerating production timelines. Despite the technological upgrades, the essence of traditional farming remains intact. The core objective still revolves around sustaining the family unit, though now with the potential for slightly larger outputs that could reach local markets. The incorporation of modern machinery not only reduces the labor intensity, but also allows these small-scale farmers to manage their resources more effectively, increasing their resilience against common challenges like unpredictable weather and crop failures. The modernization of traditional farming maintains its low environmental impact, preserving its benefits of minimal chemical use and a small carbon footprint. At the same time, it enhances productivity and soil management, preventing soil erosion, a common problem in manual farming, and promoting sustainable agricultural practices. This blending of old and new practices is crucial. It provides a viable pathway for small-scale farmers to enhance productivity while preserving the cultural and social aspects of traditional farming, such as community ties and the preservation of farming knowledge. Through this evolution, traditional farming not only supports the livelihoods of rural families, but also adapts to the modern age, making it a sustainable option that bridges the past with the future. This adaptive approach in traditional farming showcases a powerful model of how integrating technology with conventional methods can revitalize communities and secure a sustainable future 
for generations to come. Industrial farming. Welcome to the world of industrial farming, also known as commercial or intensive industrial farming, a modern, large-scale approach designed to maximize production and profit. This method, rooted in high-efficiency processes, caters to feeding the global market and supporting major food processing industries. Industrial farming's primary aim is to produce food on a large scale for market sale, striving to maximize yields for substantial profits, often with an eye towards export-oriented production. These operations span vast expanses, often hundreds to thousands of acres under corporate ownership, employing a significant workforce to manage the highly mechanized and extensive operations. At the forefront of agricultural technology, Industrial farms incorporate advanced machinery such as tractors, harvesters, and planters, all equipped with GPS and satellite technology. The integration of automated systems for digital monitoring, drones for precise crop surveillance, and sophisticated irrigation systems exemplifies the cutting-edge technology driving these operations. The practices within industrial farming typically focus on monoculture the specialization in a single crop that enables streamlined operations and economies of scale. This method often relies heavily on chemical fertilizers and synthetic pesticides, alongside genetically modified crops, to ensure consistently high yields. Precision farming techniques and automated irrigation systems further optimize production, emphasizing the innovative spirit of industrial agriculture. However, the economic landscape of industrial farming involves high capital investments and substantial operating costs. Despite these expenditures, the benefits of economies of scale and potentially high returns make this a viable, although expensive, market-driven venture. Farms like these are well integrated into global supply chains, featuring extensive storage facilities, on-site processing capabilities, and robust transportation infrastructure to support extensive distribution networks. Despite its productivity, industrial farming is look over for its significant environmental footprint, characterized by substantial water usage, chemical runoff, soil degradation, and high energy consumption, contributing to a large carbon footprint. Socially, while it stands as a major employer in rural areas and plays a significant role in economic contributions, its scale and methods can sometimes negatively impact small farmers and influence global food security dynamics. Industrial farms encounter a variety of challenges, including the need for high initial investments and exposure to market price fluctuations. They must also navigate stringent environmental regulations and manage public perception concerns. Additionally, these farms deal with issues related to pest and disease management, labor availability, and the inherent risks posed by weather conditions. In short, industrial farming is a powerhouse of food production capable of feeding millions and influencing international trade. Organic farming. Organic farming is a method deeply committed to environmental sustainability and the production of food without synthetic chemicals. This approach not only maintains soil health and promotes biodiversity, but also adheres strictly to organic certification standards ensuring that products meet the highest ecological benchmarks. Organic farming focuses on sustainable practices that exclude synthetic inputs like pesticides, GMOs, and artificial fertilizers to preserve natural resources and promote soil health. This method involves techniques such as crop rotation, natural composting, and using beneficial insects for pest control, ensuring ecological balance. Despite its higher labor and certification costs, Organic farming commands premium prices and offers significant environmental benefits, including enhanced biodiversity, improved water quality, and reduced pollution. However, organic farmers face challenges such as lower yields initially, vulnerability to weather, and complex certification processes. Economically, while it involves higher upfront costs, the niche market for organic products provides substantial marketing advantages. Socially, this approach boosts worker safety, offers healthier food options, and enhances community engagement through educational initiatives, contributing positively to rural development. Organic farming thus stands out as a crucial, sustainable agricultural practice that supports both environmental stewardship and community well-being.
Protected agriculture. Protected farming, also known as controlled environment agriculture, focuses on maximizing agricultural production through year-round cultivation, irrespective of external weather conditions. This innovative approach not only increases yield per area, but also ensures consistent quality and the production of premium products. The primary goal of protected farming is to control the growing environment, allowing for protection from weather extremes and enabling higher yields and quality control. The main structures used include greenhouses, constructed from glass or plastic, that regulate temperature, humidity, light, and ventilation. Protected farming employs various sophisticated growing systems such as hydroponics, where plants grow in a soilless water environment, aeroponics, which involves growing plants in an air or mist environment without soil, vertical farming, which utilizes vertically stacked systems, aquaponics, which combines fish and plant production, and container farming. These systems are complemented by advanced technology integrations like climate control systems, automated irrigation, LED growing lights, CO2 enrichment, nutrient dosing systems, and environmental sensors, all controlled by computer systems for precision management. Although protected farming requires high initial investments and has higher operating costs, it offers the potential for premium product prices and year-round income due to reduced crop loss and better market timing. This method is perfect for cultivating high-value crops like vegetables, leafy greens, herbs, and flowers, as well as specialized products like nursery plants and microgreens. In essence, protected farming represents a forward-thinking approach to agriculture that meets modern demands for food safety and sustainability, promising a stable, profitable future for farmers and a reliable supply of high-quality produce for consumers. Mixed farming. Mixed farming is a holistic agricultural approach that combines crop cultivation with animal husbandry, and sometimes even fish farming, to create a diversified and sustainable farming system. This method leverages the integration of these components to generate multiple revenue streams and promote efficient resource cycling. The essence of mixed farming lies in its ability to integrate the cultivation of various crops with the rearing of livestock, offering a balanced use of resources. Animals provide natural fertilizer for the crops, while the crop residues turn into feed for the livestock creating a closed-loop system that enhances soil health and overall farm efficiency. This system may also extend to include fodder production to support the livestock component. Mixed farming is renowned for its ability to distribute risk and provide year-round income, thanks to its diverse activities. Common combinations found in mixed farming systems include grain crops with dairy cattle, vegetables with poultry, fruit trees with sheep or goats, and even rice with fish. These combinations ensure that the farm can operate more sustainably and maintain a steady cash flow. From an economic perspective, mixed farming offers significant advantages by providing multiple sources of income and reducing input costs. The synergy between the different farming activities leads to better cash flow management and greater market flexibility, enhancing the overall sustainability of the farm. Despite its many benefits, mixed farming requires complex management and is labor-intensive. It demands a diverse set of skills from the farmer, effective space management, and often a substantial initial investment in multiple systems. Managing such a farm can be challenging but rewarding, offering a resilient model that can adapt to market changes and environmental conditions. In short, mixed farming presents a robust model of agriculture that combines the best of both worlds, crop production and livestock rearing. This integrated approach not only optimizes resource use, but also stabilizes income, making it an attractive option for those looking to enhance the sustainability and profitability of their farming operations. Extensive farming. It is an agricultural method that utilizes vast land areas to produce food, relying on the natural fertility of the soil and climatic conditions rather than heavy input of labor, capital, or technology. This method is often seen in regions where land is abundant, but less fertile, making large-scale cultivation feasible without intensive resource investment. The key advantages of extensive farming include lower production costs, reduced environmental impact through minimal chemical use, and greater resilience to market fluctuations. However, it typically yields lower productivity per unit area 
and is more vulnerable to weather changes. Despite these challenges, extensive farming plays a crucial role in sustainable agriculture, particularly in less densely populated regions where intensive farming is not viable. It emphasizes environmental sustainability, promoting better soil conservation, biodiversity preservation, and sustainable water usage. Intensive farming. Intensive farming is an agricultural approach that maximizes crop yields and livestock production through high inputs of capital, labor, and technology. This method involves extensive use of chemical fertilizers and pesticides, advanced machinery, and sophisticated farming techniques such as GPS-guided tractors and precision agriculture to increase efficiency and production on a limited land area. The key characteristics of intensive farming include high crop yields, significant mechanization, and reliance on chemicals to boost productivity. It also encompasses factory farming and confined animal feeding operations, CAFOs, where livestock are raised in high-density settings with automated feeding and milking systems to optimize output. The advantages of intensive farming are clear. It offers higher yields per unit area, making efficient use of land and meeting high food demands. It can also lead to higher economic returns due to economies of scale and continuous production cycles. However, this method requires substantial initial and ongoing investments and has significant environmental and ethical concerns, such as soil degradation, water pollution, high greenhouse gas emissions, and questions regarding animal welfare. Despite its productivity benefits, intensive farming faces criticism for its environmental impact, including the degradation of soil and water quality, and its heavy carbon footprint. As such, there is a growing trend towards integrating more sustainable practices within intensive farming to mitigate its adverse effects and enhance its long-term viability. Conservation Agriculture As the last farming method in our exploration, Conservation agriculture stands out for its sustainable approach to farming. This method emphasizes minimal soil disturbance, maintaining soil health, and promoting biodiversity, all geared towards sustainable agricultural production. It is anchored in three core principles, minimal tillage, permanent soil cover, and diversified crop rotation. Conservation agriculture focuses on reducing soil erosion and enhancing soil structure through practices like zero or reduced tillage and direct seeding. It encourages permanent soil cover using crop residues and cover crops, which protect the soil from erosion and help conserve moisture. Diversification through systematic crop rotation and intercropping enhances soil fertility and mitigates pest and disease risks, further stabilizing the ecosystem. The benefits of conservation agriculture are profound both environmentally and economically. Environmentally, it reduces soil erosion, improves water retention, and lowers carbon emissions, contributing to greater climate change resilience. Economically, it reduces the need for costly machinery and chemical inputs, leading to lower production costs and improved long-term yields and profitability. Despite its advantages, Conservation agriculture faces challenges such as the initial investment required for new equipment, a learning curve for adopting new practices, and ongoing technical challenges like soil compaction and nutrient management. However, modern applications are integrating advanced technologies such as GPS-guided equipment, precision farming tools, and digital soil mapping to overcome these barriers. Looking to the future, Conservation agriculture is expected to advance further with the development of more efficient equipment, improved crop varieties, and better pest and disease management techniques. This method is set to play a crucial role in sustainable development, promoting food security, environmental protection, and resource conservation, making it a pivotal component of future agricultural strategies. That wraps up our journey through the diverse world of farming methods. I hope you enjoyed it and these concepts will help your farming setups for success. If you found this video informative, like, subscribe, and click the bell icon to stay updated with our latest content. Happy farming and see you in the next video.